Something I can do for you, friend. And who are you supposed to be that's asking? Oh, welcome, my lady. Haven't seen that fellow Christoph for almost a week now. Not sure where he went. His room's paid up to the end of the month. I guess he expected he'd be here a while. Of course. Here you go. It's the last room at the end of the hall. If he comes back and gets upset, however, it's on your head. On it. Been dead for days. That answers that, I suppose. The Darkspawn are definitely here. Yes, that is your Grey Warden. The mother told it to me that if he was lured to this place and slain, that in time you would come. And the mother, she was right. The mother is always right. An ambush. An attack, yes? This here, it is no attack. I, here before you, is the first. And I am bringing to you a message. The mother, she is not permitting you to further his plan, whether this you know or not. So she is sending you a gift. Well, it cannot be this. The mother, she has deceived me. I am betrayed. Now I am being trapped in the fade with you. Ah, oh, I am the fool. First, I am not being expendable. Both the Grey Warden and the Mother shall be learning this. I will be leaving you to the children. I will be finding my own path back into the world. Back to the Mother. You're not a spirit like everyone else. How did you get here? You were forced to come here? That's very strange. This is where my grandfather's ashes are buried. I come to visit him often. He was the last person to stay in Black Marsh. Once he passed, there was nobody left in the village who remembered. Remembered what happened to the village, of course. 
The marsh was full of people once. Then that evil woman came and changed everything. She... Oh no! They've come back again. Quick, come hide in the crypt! And so you came. Fell into my little trap. Such wonderful creatures, you mortals. So full of yearnings. So full of hunger. Hmm, you do outnumber me now, it's true. Clearly, you mortals are not frail. Very well. Let the Baroness have you. I shall feed on whatever remains. <laughs> halt! Who enters the Black Marsh? Trapped? Then you're just as we are, locked in this endless nightmare. We've been here so long at her mercy. I almost forget what it was like before. There is a spirit that's come to free us. Perhaps you could help him. If only that were possible. The mansion will not protect you, fiend. Come out and face your crime. We aren't afraid of you any longer. The witch hides. Break down the door. Be cautious, my friends. The Baroness has power within her lair, and she well knows it. We rush in at our peril. And who comes now? More minions of the Baroness? Or yet more helpless souls she has tormented? I cannot say what a Grey Warden is, but clearly you are a stranger. Perhaps it is a sign. I am Justice. I have watched this place and seethed that the wrongs visited on these poor folk. And now I seek to aid them. Once we lived in the real world and the Baroness ruled over us. She took our children and used their blood to work dark and evil magic. And when we burned down her mansion, she cast one final spell that brought our spirits here. We've been trapped ever since, still under her rule. We have to help these people. It must be terrible to be trapped in this grey, lifeless world. I think that since the Baroness trapped these people here, that she's our best chance of getting out. Tell me, stranger, will you help us in this righteous task? Being a Grey Warden appears to make you an able sort, and thus your aid would be most welcome. These good people have been held in the thrall of this sorceress for too long. I seek to free them. It's been a nightmare that seemed to go on forever. Until justice arrived, we didn't even know this wasn't real. I can no longer stand by and watch. The sorceress has fled into her lair, but a reckoning is called for. We must act, stranger. From the world of mortals, as are all these people. We lived in a village in the Black Marsh, and the Baroness ruled over us, but it was so long ago it seems like a dream we once had. We finally rose up against her evil, and this is what she did to us. I can't even imagine what happened to our families. Has it been so long? How many years have we been held here? Take heart, good woman. Justice will see you avenged and freed. Will you help us, stranger? If this wrong is to be undone, we will need your aid. Then we have the numbers to challenge the Baroness directly. They just said she was an evil, powerful witch. Do, do we really want to antagonize her? You convince me. My intention is to storm the gate. Are you ready? Good people, we take the battle directly to the witch. For too long have her crimes gone unpunished. 
Now is the time to reclaim your freedom! My, my. All that shouting outside, and now you finally decided to barge in without even a proper invitation. Foul sorceress. You will release these poor folk and submit yourself to justice. Justice? Is that what you're calling it? What of their punishment? Burning my home to the ground and me within it. Because you were stealing our children, using their blood to feed your vanity. As was my due. You lived on my land, I, your rightful ruler. Your blood was mine, just as your lives are now. What's this? The pathetic fools have managed to recruit yet more sympathizers? We are no longer alone, Baroness. Your reign ends here. As it happens, I am no longer alone either. My path back across the Vale lies in victory over you and your new allies. Then the Mother will pay for her treachery. Instead, I should have chosen you, mortal. We must be ending this. Now! The Grey Warden, it is more dangerous than you know. Oh, as you wish, creature. Slay them, and you shall have the reward you requested. Enough! The battle is joined! Now, before it is too late! Oh, I will sunder the veil, all right. I'll send them all back, but you, your life is going to provide the power. No, no. What is happening? No. This is the world of mortals. Beyond the veil. And this... This is... A mortal body of flesh. I am trapped within. The witch sundered the veil in her haste. All of us were drawn through. She has returned to this realm as well. Can you not feel it? The Baroness is nearby. You misunderstand. The Baroness, she is not as mortal as you are, or as were the villagers she kept trapped. There was such a mortal once, but now? That is a demon of pride. She assumed that role long ago to feed from the mortal she trapped. But here, in your world, here she will be quite something else. I do not know why I am in this body. It was not by choice, I assure you. The veil is sundered. And the tears must be closed, lest they continue to spill demons out into this world. I can alter your weapons for a time, allowing them to drive back the Fade's magic. 
But if we are to deal with the Baroness, we must move swiftly. So this is the world of mortals. How very dull it seems. So immutable and unchanging. Yet... I am here. I have crossed the veil. The spirits will watch in envy as the mortals of this realm bow down before me. That will not happen, demon. Ah. It seems I was not the only one to be drawn here. How very tiresome. I have harnessed the power of those fools trapped in our realm for an eon. My true form has substance here. I had no idea I could enter the mortal world this way. Had I known... Oh, but I am here now, yes? Soon I will be queen as this world deserves. And you... You will be the first of my subjects. So, it is done. For what it is worth, thank you. I have fulfilled my vow. May the victims of that woman's madness rest in peace, wherever they have gone to now. No, the spirits believe there is a place beyond the Fade, but we have no more answers to such things than you mortals. It seems I cannot return to the Fade. I am trapped here. ...in the body of this... ...Grave Warden. There are memories within this poor man's mind. They are... ...they're difficult to see. But... ...he was a Grey Warden? He was... ...slain... ...by the Darkspawn. The one called the First? And that was your pursuit when you were tricked into the Fade. Yes, I understand now. It seems I am at a loss. I know nothing of this world and have only a few memories of this Grey Warden to draw from. I do not wish to die. What shall I do, mortal? You seem to be a creature of good character and you are of this world. Can you advise me? You mean continue this mortal's mission as a Grey Warden? It was a Darkspawn who murdered this mortal most ignobly. And the ones that commanded it yet live. To avenge his death. Yes, that would be a purpose. Very well. I will join you, Grey Warden, if you will allow it. That is not my name. I have no name. Only a virtue to which I aspire. If I am to need a name, then use that. I am Justice, and for now I am pleased to travel at your side, Grey Warden. Mother? It comes with sweet news, I hope. Tell the mother. The first, it is dead. The Grey Wardens are gone from the marsh. Wicked, wicked Wardens. They killed the first, killed him! Cut the mother's heart! <laughs> but was it not the mother who wished him dead? Day will come when the sun. 
silence ends. <laughs>